And here's an even tougher conversation I'm going to throw at you guys. Here's an even tougher conversation I'm going to throw at you guys. And hit that like button if you haven't done so. Subscribe to the page. Do you believe that Tyson Bajant is one of the top 32 quarterbacks in the NFL? Because I do. I think that Tyson Bajan is better than some NFL starters that are in the league right now. And I'm trying to pull up a list of all the starting quarterbacks for the season here. This was a lot bigger of a list than I thought it was going to be here. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Let's run through some of these names. Now, I don't think that you'll do this because of division. But if Minnesota called you, do you feel that Tyson Bajan is better than Sam Darnold? I do. Will Levis is probably better. I would say Stroud is better. Steelers is a weird situation. I doubt that we'll see another quarterback going over there. Um, maybe midway through the season, there's a conversation there. Uh, New Orleans with Derek Carr. I, I'm going to still give Derek Carr the edge there, but you know that they're looking for new. Uh, Matt Stafford. Vegas Raiders. Tyson Bajan knows the system already that's going on out there. Could we see something like that? Patriots. I think that Tyson Bay just got the edge there. Panthers. I think that's just a bad situation. Don't trade him to, to, to the Panthers if you did something like that. Um, we keep going. Daniel Jones. Give me Tyson Bajan. Uh, Who else we got on here? Commanders got their situation locked up. Indianapolis Colts. Anthony Richardson. Anthony Richardson. I mean, who knows? I mean, that's a weird situation. Cleveland Browns with Deshaun. I think they're probably rolling with Deshaun no matter what there. Broncos has already picked up. Uh, I would say give me Bo Nix over Tyson probably. Uh, but, I mean, when you're talking about top quarterbacks in the NFL or top starters, I should say, in the NFL, if you get a call for Tyson Bajan, hey, we got a fourth-round pick, future fourth. We want your backup quarterback. You doing it? Are you are you moving on? Because you have to understand where the league is going as well. You have to keep up with, with where the league is heading. You've got an NFL that is probably going to 18 games. I would, dare I say, as soon as next season, possibly. You're going to 18 games probably as soon as next season. You're going to need a good backup quarterback. Now, the question is, can you keep re-signing Tyson Bajan just to be your backup, or do you end up losing him for nothing in the long run? But if a team comes calling about Tyson Bajan, are you moving off of? That's that's a tough I I'm I'm not going to lie to you. That's a tough call for me. Because while I do think that there is value in one having a guy like Brett Rippon who's also a solid backup quarterback in this league, while I do think there's value there, I think that we're moving towards the time where you almost have to have a backup quarterback that you feel ridiculously good about, not just a body. You're going to have to have backup quarterbacks. You're going to start seeing guys draft quarterbacks just to be the backup quarterbacks. Guys who are solid pieces. You're going to start seeing teams do that because of the length of the season. Oh, and a lot of what you're going to see as well is what the Bears did. You're going to see a ton of... Um, bringing in four or five quarterbacks, getting a bunch of guys to understand the system, getting a bunch of guys to understand the terminology because of situations like this where teams are going to go, you know, maybe we move on from this guy because he's in a contract year, but we got this pipeline of QBs already ready to go. 
I think that's a tough conversation to have, but it may end up being a real conversation that gets had because I'm not going to lie to you. As we start to go through the season, there are there are some quarterbacks out there that just aren't good. Can I start it over with a 24-year-old player who has a ton of upside right now? by giving up some draft capital. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Hit that like button, subscribe to the page, leave that five-star view. Y'all know what to do. Levante said, it ain't tough at all. Keep Bajan. <laughs> I like, I love that we've like got so much love for the backup QB as well. I love that we have so much love for the backup QB as well. Happy said, you need a competent backup quarterback in this league nowadays. Too many injuries every year. We saw what happened last year. 100%. I agree with you. I agree with you. I think that you do. I think that you do. Well, listen, Ebony. Ebony, listen. He said he'd rather get a second for Beja. If somebody offers you a second for Beja, hey, we appreciate you, Tyson. You give him the, give him the two hand shake. You know what I mean? You know where you grab both sides of the hand and shake? You know what I mean? You, we appreciate you, brother. Hey, hey, you you keep your head up. Keep the hair growing. Hey, you pack your stuff. <laughs> Somebody offers you a two for Tyson Beijing. You tell him, you help him start. Pay. Like, no, no, don't even worry about it. We got somebody already packing your things. How'd you get in my house? Don't worry about it. We know where the key's at. But. I just, I feel like you have to, that's not as easy of a conversation as it once was. And you also have to take into account, while yes, we may all want Tyson on this team, we may all want Tyson to continue to be a part of this team, but at the end of the day, does Tyson want to continue to be a backup player? Probably not. We heard him in, the, in uh, Hard Knocks say, you know, I don't want to be, my, my goals are not to be a player coach. Some people are resigned to that. Some people are okay with, oh, I'm going to just be the player coach guy. I'm going to be the guy that, you know what I mean? Hey, this, this is not a bad a bad line of work. I get paid, what is he, $2.7 over three years? Not a bad line of work at all to just be the, 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 the clipboard guy. It's not what Tyson wants. Tyson said, give me, give me, uh, get, get me in the game, coach. I can go win some games for you. So you have to take that into account as well. Cause you could lose Tyson just because Tyson don't want to be a backup no more. You know he's got to be looking around the league going, I know I can outplay that guy. And I'm not gonna lie to you. If you are a young quarterback, if you're a young quarterback right now and you look at New York, are you not saying send me there? If you look at the Giants right now or even the Jets, what I got to do? I got to sit behind Aaron Rodgers for a year, two years? I can do that. When you look at both New York teams, Is that not the spot you want to be in? Wait a minute. Who's my head coach? I get Brian Dable as a head coach. What's, what's he been doing? Oh, just trying to stay alive with Daniel Jones? Okay. No, we can make that. Okay. All right. Uh, who's my wide receiver? Malik Neighbors. Oh, they just got Neighbors. Okay. Uh, no, I, I, I can make something work over there. I can make that happen. Like I, I, I just feel like we're in a we're coming into a different world with the with the backup quarterback market, and are you going to look to? <clears throat> are you going to look to raise the price on backup QBs to keep a guy like Bajan around? Right now, you don't have to have that conversation. That's more of a future conversation. But it is a conversation you're going to have to have when he continues to play the way that he's been able to play. Like Levante said, or you pay him handsomely. Are we going to raise the price 
on the backup QB market. I think you're going to see a healthy flux of money start to go that direction for teams that have good backups. I think you're going to start seeing teams get or uh, backup QBs getting paid a little bit more because of the length of games that's going to happen during the season. With Lamar Jackson, you almost expect, you almost expect for him to miss three to four games a year. Chicago Bears, shout out to you. Don't know how you got that name, but this is the real Chicago Bears in here, but that's not the logo that I remember seeing. I uh, said, disagree, Chicago is a better spot. I'm not saying that Chicago is not a better spot to be, but it's about, do you want to start? If I want to be a starter and I'm a young backup QB and I feel like I'm better, I'm looking at the Giants and going, I got Brian Dabo, Malik Neighbors. I got some pieces I can work with over there. I got a great head. I got a great system to be in and uh, a solid defense that just added Brian Burns. No, I can make something happen there. Let's go do it. Let's go have some fun. But that's just me. If I was young and, and playing in the NFL, that's the, those are the teams that I would look at, especially if I'm playing like Tyson because I go, I know I can beat Daniel Jones. I know I'm better than him. Daniel Jones can't throw the football out of the end zone to not throw a pick six into the end zone. How do you even do that? <laughs> There's a lot of tough decisions that are going to have to be made. We're going to break it down even more today at four. Me and the super producer, Joel Holt, will be live again at four. Stay tapped in with us, man. Hit that like button if you haven't done so. Subscribe to the page. Lead a five-star view. Y'all know what to do. I'm going to leave y'all with that. That's the question of the day right now. If a team comes calling about Tyson Bajan, do you trade him? I'll leave you guys with that. I appreciate y'all for showing love as always, man. Uh, like I said, we'll be back today at four. Y'all stay safe out there, Chicago. Bird Don, one love. Peace. Little, let's do a little outro music on that. How about, how about a little outro? A little, little outro music. Right? I'll let y'all know. Best show for Chicago sports.